Hey guys, what's up and welcome to GA Entertainment. In this wonderful After Effects tutorial, I am going to show you how you can use different smith effect in After Effects. With this effect, you can remove your video background without any green screen if you have. So you can remove your video background without any green screen with this wonderful effect. So let's start. So here is my video and I have solid white background. You need to have a solid white background because it will work better. And also you need to have different color of your chart with your background. So it will work very better. So let's start. First of all create new solid. Okay now solid color must be match to your background color. Like I picked this color picker and matched it. Okay that's right now turn off your solid and drop it below your video that's right select your video clip and uh, go to effects now go to king and click on different smith now here different layer select your solid because this will be reference for your the difference layer so select that solid which is barely orange solid one so select that one here okay now play around matching troll at tallness let me turn off this so remove your background with this effect but keep in mind don't lose your uniform you are short your face like 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 this point is good okay no problem now select everything select your all layers select your all layers and control shift c by this you will have pre-compose so pre-compose everything and name it like one is first layer okay well what you can you can name it now again create new solid and this time pick this point color again turn off this and select your layer and again apply different smith effect which is in recent again you can go to key light but here i have already in recent so now again select your solid here and play with your uh, right 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 here this thing is good now control a control shift c to pre-compose again every time you can do this when you have to remove so again solid and pick color and ok turn off this again and again select your layer and apply that effect again select with difference layer your solid and play with draw less right ok control a to select everything and you can do everything like this do it every time when you have your clean background right so i am doing again Right, right, right. Oh, oh. Let me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. 
right so i'm doing it when i have a clean background i think i like this i will mask it around or i can do it again all right so you can see it's clean we have a clean background everything is removed but you can notice this point is also removed because that was matching to our background so keep in mind you have short color that not matching to your background if you have some point like this or some like this you can fill out this by a technique let me show you Control a to select everything Control shift c okay now duplicate your layers let me turn off this one now for this go to effects and in effects you need to apply some fill effect on this and give it any color so i will color it uh, i will find a fill effect here in effects I'll apply that effect here on my layer and that's right again I will go to fast I will search for fast blur effect and I will increase blur value even I have filled out this I when this black area will be invisible and will become red so let me do it that's right now I will create new solid and I will make it color blue or I think green color yeah let's we'll make like a green screen so okay now I will drop it below my so this layer. I will select these these two layers, and I will pre-compose these two layers. I will remove background from my. I will remove green screen with key light effect. This time, I will remove this that's right now I'll play now I will drop it below here I will turn on, on my first layer now I will, will again select my this layer I go to screen mate I will increase clip black no 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 I'll increase this Everything is fixed and this area are now right and now filled with red area so you can do it like this now select everything okay now again search for fill effect and apply fill effect to this all right now make it color white now duplicate this layer again now we have two red, white solid two layers so I duplicated this okay now we need to have our original layer which is will be here which we haven't worked on it right yeah this one is my original layer 
so copy your original there now go to now go to your composition here right now paste your layer all right now let me remove this remove your effect from first layer this one now drop this layer between your these two layers now here select if you don't see you can toggle switch it now here select it luma matte pre compose and now we have removed our background the second technique that i used for which is the fill effect and blur i used for to fill in these white areas otherwise you can do the first technique and you will have remove your background with these different matte effects all right let me play so thank you guys for watching this video if you learned this really then please like our video share with your friends subscribe to our channel and we'll see you next time bye